wonder if I'm gonna have to do that fight over again. Oh, it counted. Nice. I'm surprised. Hello, Cali, for the third time. <laughs> This time I don't. It keeps giving me errors. Apparently there's something going on with the internet, or my system is goofy. I've never had errors on this game. I've had problems with YouTube before, but I've never gotten an error on the game itself. All right, where are we at? We need to go to this. Fort Faroff in this cave. Let's try to do the back way to the to the ball. Dragon.
wonder what kind of damage I can do to him with this stuff. Let's try it. How can I... Can I use my Mimic on him? Dunking him. Alright, that's the second time I've tried that. Apparently they fixed it. Can't kill him more than once. Alright, let's see. We've been putting the points into Arcane. Let's 
Let's go get poisoned. She's dead, dude. She's dead. Chill, chill, chill. Excessive. And that's how you get the news. here <clears throat> got half our medallion we still have to get the other half
One of these streams we're gonna have to go through and do all the night guys. I've only done three of them so far. Stop it. You were just guarding beast blood? Okay. hidden I'm like right in front of it there it is Summoning altar in this room? I guess not. Well, whatever. <coughs> I'm just glad that first cave counted after the error. Oh, there it is. I was gonna be pissed off if I was gonna have to do that fight again. What? Hyper armor from standing up. Snail! Two snails! America, so you know shit's about to get real.
I should go back and go down. Eh, I don't need to. I got all that stuff. Oh, shit. What the hell? You almost hit me with your snail trail. that leaves two or three more caves and tunnels. Cave. That's gallery. Yeah. And I killed him one last time and left and came back and he was there. He was all talking shit because I did it. <laughs> Need to go to the Divine Tower as well. Uh, what was that? Was that number one? It's number two.
What's going on? What is that? Bracco Star. How you doing today? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that shit. I'm doing great. Working on my third run through Elden Ring, trying to get the platinum. Had two had two errors starting off right out the gate, but so far so good this time. Co-op bot, huh? <clears throat> well, I mean, I think I'm 12 away from 200. Uh, one of these streams, I was thinking about doing. Uh, if anyone needs help, I'm doing pretty good myself. Let's see, what am I? Uh, level 241. This run, first run, I did strength. This time, I'm doing. Strength and feet. Since I already had strength, walk the swing and a miss. Dude, seriously, how can you keep missing? You're locked on. And this time, I'm on this paladin run. I've been uh, doing dragon powder powers and black blade. And then uh, I've been adding points into Mind and Faith. Or not Mind and Faith, but Mind and uh, Arcane. I started doing Arcane just recently. So I'm just adding more and more devastation to my attacks. Beating Mel Melania twice. First time she uh, kicked the shit out of me until I used the proper sword and proper cold attachment. She did not like. Me and the mimic beat the shit out of her. Totally bullied the hell out of her. Second time she gave me a little bit of a challenge. That cave must be up high. Yeah, that and uh Discovery, because I've been farming armor suits and stuff. You know, I'm one of these people that's just a loot whore. I gotta have it all. And some of those guys, like the uh, fire monks and stuff, you know, they don't drop stuff. Oh, it's on the other side of the wall. They don't drop that stuff very uh, often. So I'm trying to get more into <clears throat> more into arcane so I can get the suits I. Because you know, you gotta have the drip. Can't just run around looking like a I found this on the ground type of person. Yeah, I've been using Tish as well. Mimic for if I get into a lot of trouble or if I think I'm gonna have an issue and then just checking out Tish to see how she does. She's not bad. further away from that cave. I cannot remember. Is it down here? You can 
still get mimic. Or you you try you talking about something else. I just got her again on this run. Or it. I've never used I never used Tish or anything like that, so there it is. I'm also gonna level up some of the other guys. I've got I've got so many to use. Oh you haven't got that far yet. I gotcha. See what you get mimic is it in the is it in the Narcon? Narcon? I believe it is. Yeah, that's a that can be a hard area. Yeah, Tish. Her name is Tish. Uh let's see, let me show you. This one right here. Black knife Tish. T I C H E. That's a hard fight to get her. Hard fight. Yeah, not as tough as the Mimic, but I used the Mimic, what, first two runs? So this time I'm, uh, I'm trying, trying not to use the summoning, but, you know, I just did a triple crystal fight, so I pulled it out. <laughs> I mean, I'm willing to help anyone who wants to help, or wants to help. I'm no let me solo, solo her, but I can do some, I can do some damage. Oh, this is that one you get teleported to, isn't it? I think it is. Hey, that's not cool. This is that room you get teleported to. The trap room. First time I got teleported here, I was like level 5. I got the shit kicked out of me. I had to run. And then eventually I just couldn't get out of here. I had to teleport out. I know there's more than one of those guys. I can hear him. There you are. Come down here. Come down here. Fine. Damn land lobster. Yeah, for the most part, just trying not to use summonings. And I'm uh, this time I'm dual wielding. I didn't dual wield last time. Or any time. Tell you the truth. I was just running around with... The first time I used... What was it? Uh, hang on, let me take this guy out before I do anything. Anybody else? So the first time I ran through, I used the Lord Sworn Longsword for the lo most part until I got something that, and then I was able to finally wield this, the uh, Grafted Blade. But once I got the the Great Sword leveled up, this thing is just an absolute trolly little sword. Well, it ain't little, but. Uh, well, I mean, I've I've never played any of the Dark Souls games. I'm usually a 
survival game player, uh, COD player, Battlefield, that kind of stuff. But COD is just absolute trash and has been for the last three or four games, in my opinion. I liked playing DMC. I wish they would have continued that on. I think it has lots of potential. Many, many people like playing it. But like, if you go try to play it now, pretty much everybody's gotten everything done, so it's just a giant PvP game. I keep forgetting to change... I have a lightning on one of these, and it gives me a little lightning attack, but the actual attack is kind of terrible. It's not bad when I have all my stuff on, because I'm running lightning buffs. But this one, this one is an absolute monster of an attack. Usually two, three hits will break any big boy. I haven't found many that it doesn't break. Oh shit, I can't get up there. How did I get up there? Oh. Oh no! Oh well. Yeah, I mean, Activision is a terrible company when it comes to that kind of stuff, so they've ruined it. <laughs> I mean, I, I'll, all the streamers and stuff have also done that as well, you know, coming in saying, oh, use this gun, use these attachments. Well, of course, COD and Activision, they, they played off of that, you know, making bundles that have the new meta in it so they can make a bunch of money, and then, uh, the streamers, of course, push all that because it's content and it makes them money. You know, so that's kind of ruined everything. And then, on top of that, the microtransactions are like, what? Black Cell upgrade is 30 bucks. I've seen some of the skin packs, 30 bucks. I think there's one that was 40. It's just, it's, oh shit, I almost fell. It's gotten out of hand. You know, I enjoy playing that game. I haven't played Battlefield since Battlefield 4. I didn't seem like 2042 was going to be my cup of tea, but I heard they've made a lot of changes, but... You know, I'm more into, like, the Milsim type stuff. You know, I want it more realistic. And Modern Warfare 2, the relaunch, even though it wasn't a new game, was a lot closer to that. Everybody couldn't do what they want to do. Lots of people couldn't make content off of it the way they used to. The one-shot sniper disappeared, which I think is kind of stupid. I like the fact that you could set one of the guns up to do that, but... Well, now, you can set up your physics... Wonder Physics Jar to do that, and then... If they're standing in water, it amplifies the damage as well. So if you've got Golden Vow on, Flame Grant Me Strength, my Wonder Physics with the extra holy and uh, or extra yeah, it was extra holy and extra lightning. When I throw a lightning bolt into water, it it does some serious damage. Not as much as it used to, from what I understand, but. It still does quite a bit. And then I switched to... Was it Fortisax's Lightning? I was using the one from Plastics. The big one, AoE. But that one is like... It's better for the big boys. And then... It doesn't do as much damage as it used to. Like, I might get max 8,000 damage out of it. Which, I mean, is a lot. But it's still not enough. Ashes of Creation. Oh, really? Hey, man, the indie indie studio games are can be some really good games. They they can be cheap. 
they can have some decent gameplays on them. You know, and in my opinion, you don't have to have a AAA rated game to have fun. I mean, I play Minecraft a lot. That, that's not a triple. I mean, I guess it kind of is now, but it's still a twenty-dollar video game. It doesn't take up hardly any room. Hours and hours and hours of entertainment. So it's like, as long as you're having fun. Oh, that's all they were guarding was the heirloom. You know, if you enjoy your indie games, then have at it. Like right now, I was streaming this all the time. Now that I'm on my third run and I'm almost done with the Platinum, I'm waiting for the DLC to come out. I started a Fallout 4 one again, which is an old game, but it's still fun. And then I'm doing Assassin's Creed Black Flag, which is an old game. I never played it. I'm not too sure about it yet. I might switch to Valhalla or Origins. But I'm going to give it a chance. We'll see what happens. I didn't get a lot of you or people watching me on that one. So, not too sure. Oh, I'm doing Fallout 4. Uh-oh, that's a mistake. Oh no, he's got me trapped in the corner. Fine. You wanna play? Let's play. Oh, oh shit. Oh, damn. I forgot how much of a bitch this guy is. Yeah, I play. I was playing Odyssey. I haven't finished it, but I'm probably about three quarters of the way through when it comes to story and all that. And then I never played Black Flag, never played Freedom Cry. I haven't played Valhalla, but I have them all. So my Assassin's Creed day, I'm just going to roll right through those games. And then Fallout 4, because of the new show, I thought I'd get back into it, and I started a whole fresh save. Well, I'm glad I kicked that ladder down. Wait a minute. Did it take me back to the beginning? It did. I thought I passed a statue. I guess not. That's what I get for opening the door before I buffed. I've played all the Fallouts. And uh, I enjoy them. They're a fun game. Granted, they're on an old engine. They don't look as great. But still fun. And then the DLC that they have for it is fun. There, you can do mods on it. So like, there's the town you start off in is called Sanctuary. And my sanctuary doesn't look like it's ever been hit by nukes. Uh, I don't have everything's green in my map because I I put the mod on realistic weather that kind of stuff. You know, and uh, I have uh, the DLC, I can't, I think it's called auto Automation or something like that. Like, I can run pipe work for my power instead of just the cords everywhere. I can have, 
I have an albino death claw that wanders around like a dog in my town. I have a dog. I have cats. My town's fully, uh, fully populated by, you know, set, uh, settlers and stuff, and survivors. Yeah, I mean, I played, uh, I think it was three, and then New Vegas. New Vegas was fun, but it seemed like a short game to me. You know, and I enjoyed playing Fallout 4. I ran through that game as the Blood Brotherhood of Steel ending. There's three endings. I think this time I'm going to do the one with my son. But you can also do the Minutemen. I don't know if you... I can't remember if you can do the Minutemen and your son's ending. I think you have to do one or the other. Damn, I missed again. But if you like survival games and doing all that kind of stuff in that game, I mean, it's, it's fun. I enjoy it. And the show, of course. I like the show. I'm hoping it sets off a new game. They haven't made a Fallout in quite some time. And in 76, I don't really consider that a new game. It's It started off absolutely terrible. But I hear they've made a lot of changes and it's not as bad as it used to be. But I also have that game too, so I might I might after the Fallout 4 series, I might go into 76 and check it out. I didn't grab that last time. Yeah, you can mod it like uh, Skyrim. I don't remember when they added it, but there's a whole bunch of mods for it. You just got to be careful how much you put on it. Because it can kind of ruin the game. But I kept mine too. So the sanctuary is like a little pla like a little plateau area with a the creek around it or a river around it. So you could w I walled it off. I got gun turrets and everything. So there's one bridge in and that's it. Uh, I repaired the bridge is repaired. You can't do that unless you use a mod. When you're in the town at the beginning of the game, it looks like a 50s uh, town, and I made mine. I made mine look brand new, like it had never been hit. Yeah, and then of course, like I said, uh, realistic weather and all that stuff, and then uh, everything's green instead of everything looking dead. Because I think Fallout 4 is like, I want to say it's like four or five hundred years in the future. So it's like things would start to grow back by then. So that's why that's why I put that on. But it's crazy. You'll be wandering around and. A death claw comes out of the bushes at you, or or a bear, or shit like that. I mean, it it can get you. So it just adds a whole new experience to it. You just I don't think you can get trophies if you want trophies while that stuff is playing. All right, let's see if we can do this without my mimic. I knew he wasn't gonna let me do that. You trolly little bastard! Come on, really? I might not be able to do this. I like it. Fine, screw you.
Oh, that was a big chunk. There you go. Yeah, that uh, that Ash of War is pretty vicious. Let's see, what was it? it? I can't remember what it's called. Uh, I'd have to go to a star, a, a grace to show you, but essentially, like Godric the Gra the Godric guy. I hit him twice, and it broke his stance, right? Crit him. He only had about an eighth of an inch of health left when he went to put the dragon hand on. I just had to blow on him when he was dead. This thing is mean. <clears throat> Especially on the stars. The only problem is, is it takes so long to fire off. If you don't, if your timing's off a little bit, you can get hit pretty hard. Yeah, and if I wanted to, I could put it on both of them, but there's really no point, right? So I put the lightning on the other one, and I haven't figured out what I want on it other than that. Because, like, if I'm fighting somebody in the water and I'm a distance away, I can pop that off, and I do a bit of damage if I have all my buffs going. And I'm not into this 10-page long... You know, change your helmet, change your weapon, do this, do that, just so you can one-shot everything. I, I mean, that's cool and all, but I think it's funner just going in there and base tanking everything and beating the hell out of them. And since this is my third run, I've been going through... Oh, I forgot to go get my, my runes. I'm going to have to go back in there. I've been going through and completing everything as I go through so right now all of this is done I've done everything and right now I'm trying to finish off the caves and stuff here so I can go up into the lakes which I've been in the lakes I've been up to here I just haven't finished it all because I had to go up there so I could go fight Radon it's a fun game man lots to explore I love games like this so the DLC is going to be fun too Oh yeah, there's a lot of shit, and as you can see, I haven't been, I mean, I've been up here, but you can see where I wrote, I've been, but I haven't been back up there this run. You know, and if you like doing that one-shot stuff, there's, you know, Titus Actual has a pretty good thing where he'll show you how to do all that, and the only problem is it's like, a lot of his builds, you have to go in there and you have to hit him the first time, or you're not going to get it, right? But, I mean, it makes you feel like a god. You go in there and one-shot a boss that's got a health bar that's across your screen. Yeah, there's some pretty good ones. I mean, especially if you want to use what, the endgame sword. Do I still have that on me? I think I do. This one... Where is it at? This one. Let's watch, watch what this does. It's the rune farming sword. I've got it maxed out. And let's see, what is it? Uh, ch -ch -ch. I think this is a, a dex build one. So this one's strength, dex, and faith. And you can see the scaling on all that right there. Yeah, it's a faith and dex build. It's not an intelligence dex build. But I mean, nothing says you can't use this for dex faith and then use your your uh, Lestat staff and stuff like that to uh, do all your intelligence. You can do whatever you want, man. Whatever you want. Oh damn, I got three of those now. I don't have my... There they are. Like this staff right here. These... I think it's... I think it's this one. But... These are some bad... Look at Intelligence 52. Death... Was it... Is it... De is that a staff? Death's Poker? I don't think Death's Poker is a staff. 
No, it's not. But it also depends on which, like, if you're doing incantations and all that stuff. I mean, it all depends on what you like to play. I don't know, I've been looking at the sorcerer stuff, you know, like trying to figure out a good suit. This is my paladin look. My uh, first run I was the Raging Wolf. I went through and I got the Raging Wolf set and then I used uh, Blythe's... Oh, we gotta put my weapon back on. I used Blythe's uh, helmet and that's what I ran the whole time. If I got into trouble, I could switch could switch out a couple pe pieces for some heavy. Alright. Now we're going to go do the Everjail and the Abandoned Cave. Since they're right here. Number three. Where do I have two and one? Didn't I just turn off one by going into that cave? Nope, I didn't. There it is. There we go. The, my strength build, I had a blast with that. But like I said, I used the two-handed started off with the two-handed Lord Sworn Sword. Oh, I gotta go back and get my stuff. almost forgot. Which, granted, the chat said that, you know, I could go through the whole game if I wanted to, but... Oh, wait. Have I not got that one yet? Oh, well, here, I'll show you what this... I'll show you what that sword is good for. Where's he at? That's what that sword's good for. <laughs> Until you get to the rune farming area, of course, but it's great for killing the invisible stuff. Yeah, the Lord's Horn sword, it's a good... I liked it. I was... I mean, I struggled on some things, but of course it was my first run. But I had fun with it. I still have it, too. Where's it at? I think it's in here. Well, maybe I have it in... I might have stored it. It's the one you get right there before the entrance to uh, Stormvale Castle. That little encampment right there. It's in the back of the uh, trailer. Yeah, it's a scarab. I think so far... What? I, th I think there was five or six of them. You know, you can... You can do it without the sword. The sword just makes it easy. Yeah, that sword's a good sword. I mean, it's nothing special. Uh, I switched to the Knight's Cavalry Glaive. After that one. Oh, I might have that in storage too. Yeah, I'll put that in storage too. But I use that one because I set it up as a charge attack, piercing attack, uh, and it in it's an S scaling strength. So the more strength I got, the bat, the the better it got. the upper jail. I need to go get my stuff. Yeah, when you go to the, when you first start and you make your way over to Stormvale, you get your you talk to her and you get your torrent and then just down the way down the hill from there is that little encampment. You, uh, you kill what one guy and you can get in the chest and that's where you get the sword.
And then I ran around with that sword probably at least through Wimp Weeping Peninsula. What was it? I ran through Kaelid. I fought Radon with it. Uh, I did all that on stream too. And then you get you get the glaive from the Knight's Cavalry at night. You fight him right here. This is where he's at. He'll give you the glaive. Pretty sure that's the one. Granted, a lot of people don't like that glaive. I enjoyed it. I thought it was a fucking blast. I kicked the shit out of a, a lot of things that I probably shouldn't have been able to kick the shit out of because of it. Hey, that's not right. You should be able to do that. Oh, look, I got my fourth glaive. <laughs> See you eyeballing me. I just want my my runes back. I haven't tried two hand in that glaive yet. Oh shit! Running up on me like I owe you money. So I might I might try that out too. I don't know, did you know if you, I don't know if you found this guy yet, but this is Melania and Millicent's dad. So I finished getting uh, Millicent on to her next stage after she leaves here, and I decided to kill him. So I did. He turns into one of those things, that's what he actually is. And then when I came back, after I noticed his symbol was still there, he talks mad shit about me killing him. <laughs> he's still, he's... I, so far, he's the only NPC I've killed that came back. Which I thought was pretty funny. Come down here and fight like a bug. Fine, you want to play games? Come down here and fight me like a bug. Oh, he's out of here. I guess I'm gonna have to go up and get him. Oh, now you come down. Dude, you're pissing me off. I know when you go into the capital, man, there's a lot of those things. And they can overwhelm you pretty quick. Oh shit. Hey, don't kick me in the head. Hey, stop it! Yeah, if you want to see how I built, beat Melania, or Melania, however you want to say it, you can go back and look through the list of live streams. It's in the title. I also made a couple short, two part short out of it. The live stream's better because you get to see everything, like, from start to finish. Completely. I, it was hard to get everything in the fight. But, you use, uh, on that sword, I have Giant Slayer. And between me and the Mimic doing it, dude, she didn't stand a chance. I beat the living hell out of her. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know if you know this too. See, you know how when you do a roll and then attack, see how he does that? You don't have to roll to do that. You can just crouch roll. Crouch it. So you can literally run up, crouch. Yeah, if you go back, it's only about, let's see, in the stream, I think I fought her probably, I want to say five or six times before I, uh, some, uh, somebody in the chat told me that I could use cold on her. I was trying to figure out what she was susceptible to or weak to, and I found out, and 
through chat they told me cold was the one. There it is. Give me my stuff back. Look, golden tinted poop. I'll tell you what, so I tried to use that same sword the second run because I I could not you even with the stars and everything, she was just vicious. She was not, she was relentless on all her moves. She kept doing that multi spinning sword attack. And she'd be fighting my mimic and then just out of nowhere look at me and just come at me even though I hadn't attacked her. I was over there trying to do my buffs, stuff like that. So I pulled that sword out. I think it took me four more tries to finally beat her with that sword. Shoot, it didn't go as well as the first time. <laughs> Yeah, so if you don't have, if you don't want to roll to do that attack, you can literally just crouch. So you can do it at full run. Right? And then go into a roll and do another one. You know, so it's just, it's a nice little, nice little add, right? Gives you another move set. Plus, with the double hit, it kind of stuns them a little bit. And it's fast. It's back. The book. The big poop roller's back. Funny how this game has a thing. I know that's not poop, but that's what that is. That's a dung beetle. This thing's got a. This game's got a thing about fingers and poop. What's up, Chubbs? Try finger the butt. <laughs> oh, I thought that cave was down here. I guess not. Must be up on the ridge. Oh, give me all your goodies. Stone Firefly. Ooh, can I pick it Yeah. I need to go back up top. I don't think you can get up there. So let's see, how am I gonna do this? Should I just go? I should probably just go this way. Yeah. to go all the way back to the merchant. Go to Fair Fort Faroth and we'll take it that way. Yeah, it is a light attack for dual wield, but I tell you what, man, when you're in when you're in the middle of a fight and you like let's say you do a heavy and then crouch that and then right back into another heavy, it shortens the time a little bit. Right, so you do a heavy crouch, right? I messed it up. Heavy crouch. Come on. Now I can't do it. So running heavy crouch. Oh, it's not doing it now. 
Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button. Now I can't do it. Normally I can. It's like I do a heavy. Once it comes out, see how long it takes to do that? And then maybe, it was, maybe I was doing a light. Maybe I was doing that first. That's what it was. It was that first. But most of the time I just start with a jump attack because that's what I'm set up for. Just jump and charge. Okay, so we need to go down this road. I mean, if anything, it's just another another move that you can do without having to roll. You can do the roll, or you can not do the roll, and you still get the same attack, except for you don't get the the delay of the roll. Alright, or let's say, you know, you get you get an attack, and you have to roll toward it. It means you can do an immediate attack afterward. It's come in handy quite a bit for me. It was funny, Chubbs. I was telling my buddy that I got up to 192 on the subs from a bunch of people in his chat. And then six of them, I got eight subs out of that. Six of them unsubbed almost immediately afterward. And only two stayed. And I was like, oh, that's kind of, that's kind of funny. It's like they, uh, they just did it to be part of the crowd, you know. But, I mean, if you're not going to sit here and watch my stuff, I, I get it. Oh, wrong side. If you're not into my content or listening to me talk. But I also think that's kind of cheesy to sit there and say, Oh, because it was funny because it was like, I gave somebody, uh, I think it's his girlfriend. She hasn't even started streaming yet. She's like, Oh, I've got 31 subs. And I'm like, Nope, 32 and uh, and then I was like, keep going. I was like, I'm at 180. I think I was at 185 at the time. And then the whole chat just like, nope, you're at this, that, and then just one after another until they said I was at 192. Well, I guess we're going to go do the Everjail first. Yeah, so I, I dropped back down to one, I think it was 185, and I've gotten a couple since then. Yeah, I can't complain, man. I, I was at 32 for like five years. So it's like, this last year and a half is where I've gotten all my stuff. Oh wow, he just totally fucked me up on that. Magician versus Paladin. Ow. Dude, seriously. Wow. That club is mean. Alright, you wanna play games? Let's play games. Look at that chunk! <laughs> that was a huge chunk! Damn, I forgot how strong that is. Well, I appreciate that, Star. I hope you come join and check out the other uh, series that I have going on. I stream three days a week, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Saturday's usually the longest. 
But Tuesdays is my Elden Ring day. Thursdays is the Fallout day. Saturday is the Assassin's Creed day. Whether I keep on Black Flag or not, I'm not sure, but it will definitely be the Assassin's Creed day. And I've even thought about, like, once I get this done and then the DLC comes out, what am I going to do? Do I keep going? Do I go try Bloodborne? Do I try some... You know, i got a bunch of games in my library I have never touched. Because, you know, PlayStation Plus just gives them things away to you for, like, candy. side of the wall? Did I not see it? I can never remember where these things are at. Oh, that's a bad... Uh, ah, son of a bitch! I tried. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, I just I appreciate the support. Come watch the. T I'm halfway to my watch time. I need to get to 500 on the subs for my so I can start my monetization stuff and and then uh I haven't really had a chance to do. I haven't been doing a lot of videos. I've just been live streaming. When I was doing my COD stuff, I was doing a video a day, a short a day, sometimes multiple. You know, and then I started live streaming again, and I haven't really been into it. I, my last Elden Ring video was 20 open world bosses. I think one of them or two of them might not be an open world, but uh, got 480 views, even though I got a copyright for one of the songs in there. It happens. I got a copyright on Fallout too, because I let it sit there on the opening screen too long, and there apparently they copyright their music. And then Assassin's Creed did the same thing. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to be careful about that beginning, letting it sit there for that beginning song. It didn't hurt the channel at all, but if you're gonna allow us to stream, it's not like I'm making money off of it. The channel's not even monetized. see if I was making money off the channel. I never noticed him. He shouldn't say shit, he looks dead. Oh, well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've killed all three of them. They come back. Let's go. I thought they gave dragon hearts, but they don't. Well, I mean, the the Elden Ring video I did with the uh, the boss fights. Where did it put my shit? It better not have put it down there. It did, did it? You're kidding me. I don't see it anywhere. Man, that's some bullshit. Now I gotta fast travel back down there. Pretty sure that's it right there. Or that might be the side of grace. Uh, I made that video in Share Factory, right? Which is an editing app on the PlayStation for videos. So you would think that everything on there would be free use, and it wasn't. 
apparently one of the songs in there is copyrighted, blah blah blah. Which is fine. I mean, it didn't hurt the channel. It didn't hurt the video either. I mean, the video did very, very good considering I'm a year plus late on Elden Ring. Alright, Bracco. See you next time, man. Have a good night. Have fun at work tomorrow. I gotta do the same thing. Well, as soon as I can get into my map, I'm gonna fast travel down to my shit. Might as well go do the Divine Tower, too, since I'm over here. Come on, let me do my stuff. This is ridiculous. Let me use my map. Thank you. Jesus. Oh, it's way over there. Did I miss it? right there. Which one of it? Because there's a statue down there or something. I decided to take my shit down there. Or did I jump from down here? I don't see it anywhere. It's got to be down there. Nope, I see it. Boy, am I glad I didn't fast travel. Somewhere right here. That's where I tried to jump last time, right? Yeah. I swear I've made that jump. Maybe I was thinking about that jump. That's not a good sign when you see the devil dogs dead. Oh, that's right. This cave is in the wall. Leave me alone. I don't want to play with you. Oh, 
serpent bow. I don't think I have that. I think I'm still finding shit. Pretty sure I haven't got that yet. Hmm. Oh shit, what is that? Fire grease. Oh, it's just a flower. Mushroom heads. Uh oh. Wow, I think that was a shortcut. I remember having to run through all of that bullshit the first time. Ooh, I don't remember what this boss is, but... Let's go mess him up. I wonder how I would do it the Dark Souls games. I hear those are even harder. There's the Ever Jail, and there's that. Yep, 
Yeah, I don't know. I've never played any of them. I've seen some stuff on it. It, it looks, it looks pretty epic. But I mean, it, they're they're older games, right? So I, I don't know. Yeah, we'll just fast travel here. And we'll go do the uh, we'll go do the tower. I think the, that means one more tunnel, and we're done with Caleb, which means all three of the lower areas will be done, and then we can move up toward the lakes and start doing that stuff. Oh, wait a minute, there's that. I'm pretty sure that's a key. That's a thing back there. Wait a minute. Oh no, that's the death guy. Never mind. Remember, forget which ones explode. First time I did this one, I got knocked off by that son of a bitch over there on the fire. And somehow I survived the fall. I must have bounced off of something, but I was like, oh my god, that was a hell of a fall. How did I not die? But whatever I hit saved my ass. I mean, look at that, that's a fall. off my tower. Look at that. That's a hell of a fall. <laughs> can't, can't go any further. I know that for sure. I attempted that jump. but I could wind up dying multiple times trying to do that shit. That's not very nice. Put 
these damn ladders so close to the edge. There's my other marker. Is that red mean? right there's the the jar fight or the guys for the jar at the Coliseum and Kayla's taking me a lot longer than I thought it would to clear there's so much stuff to do over here that's a hell of a hit there buddy More poop. That goes nowhere. This is where you fall down. Broken bridge. Should have spent my runes. Oh, Jesus. Bye-bye. Bullshit just to go back. Oh. Wait. I need to go make sure I didn't miss anything down here. Fire monk! What'd he drop? What'd he drop? Damn it! I need the chest piece, you dick! That. As a matter of fact, I'm just gonna get 
turn those on. Well, that's the Black Flame Monk. I need to come in here and farm these guys. That's how you open the door. Wait a minute. That's it? I thought that was a boss fight down there. Am I tripping? What did I miss? There was a there was a fight down there. Yeah, way down there. that jump? I don't know if I can. I don't remember. Well, I guess we're gonna find out. Screw it. <laughs> that's a hell of a drop. They That's kind of bullshit. I didn't even break a foot, an ankle, nothing. farm that monk. He's the easy farmer. Oh, damn!
Oh wow. Got me. Purple strike, that's what that's called. I should have been paying more attention to my health after he tanked them lightning bolts. Alright, I guess I'll have to go full tilt. I didn't take my fat flask. Oh, I gotta put my rune back on now. Damn it. this time. One hit. I'm done. Damn. Uh oh, this might be it. I got him. I'm not sure he was going to get me with one of them attacks. I should level that up and try it. I think this one's still better. Or not this one, but the sword I used last time. Last run. Run upstairs, activate my room. Wait, what? At least I don't have to do all that stupid shit to climb the tower again. Where the hell's the door? 
Everybody's found all the secrets to this game. Ah, Mr. Two Finger, how do you do, you dead finger? Okay, what's left? been to Fort Gale. I don't know if there's a gray site there or not. Definitely been all over here. I need to go over here. If I remember right, that means I need to go here through the ravine. through the ravine. And then it's up to this tunnel. And we're done. So this might be a quick one. Alright. I'm going to fast travel, go use the restroom, grab a drink, and I will be right back. in the right way. This is the one with the giants, isn't it?
Did he get me with that? to the jaw. cool looking, wouldn't he? Hit OK. You should get their suits. Just out of range. Valent effort jar. Something else I never did. I never finished giving death roots to all the to that guy. I think I made it to four. I've never made it past that. And I wound up fighting what fighting him and it, I never went back. 
Even though you can. Like you can go there. All right, that's done. Now we have to go toward the t Gale Tunnel, which we can just fast travel to that because I've already been through the Forsaken Runes, and and then I can go to Fort Gale. And then I'll head on down and get my s runes over here for my s races. We'll save no, 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 no cron. Or should I go do no cron first? Because I still have one more ancestor to fight. I haven't done this, the upper one. I did the lower one. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. And then I'll get the other half to the lift. And then we'll go this way. Since I've already been up the left side and the middle. can't do any of that yet because I haven't or have have I finished that I can't remember I don't think I have because I haven't been teleported there yet I have to fight Ansel to get there that's right and I have not done that all right fast travel drink. God, could you imagine if you couldn't fast travel and you had to ride your horse everywhere? Which I'm surprised they didn't do like a microtransaction thing for like horse skins and like it'd been pretty cool if you could have had like a lava horse or, or a scarlet rod horse or something like that, you know, along that lines. So we're going to go to the tunnel first. Oh, there's the tunnel down low. No, looks like it's up high. Knock, knock, here I come. I told you, knock, knock. Did you not hear me? I don't know if I can... I'm pretty 
pretty sure I can put that on here. Let's see. Oh, I forgot this thing does bleed. Alright, well, let's choose a new one. I don't know if this one's better than the one I'm using already. but I don't buy it. Screw it, we're doing all lightning pretty much anyway. We'll try it out, if not we'll go back to the Fortisac stuff. Or maybe some flame sh Wait a minute, why didn't it do that to him? Hear the beast on my left, so let's go this way.
stairs almost got me. Oh, I like having those. Yeah, it is over tentacle. Cannibalize yourself. that one. I swear my mind FP bar hasn't been moving, but it's getting a little bigger. I should go put some more points into that. Telling I'm here. I hear another beast. He's over there. warm looking things or not rot looking things. Maybe I should have left my cleanse me on. Mother Scratcher, here we go. Oh, 
wants a lava worm himself. Magma worms. down to Gale, get our last sights of grace, and then head back up into Limgrave. Oh, sorry. Lakes of Lorimia. Oh, are you going to bring a friend this time? Well then, here. Yeah.
I don't know how he didn't see me. That's how you get flame gives me strength. You look like you're about to climb that ladder. Hey, this is a painting. Festival's over, buddy. I won. I have to go sell something. I got doubles of everything. Triples now, I think. I don't know. I didn't run through the entire game the second run through like I did this time. So that takes me to the fucking fortress. Don't care about that. In there, done that, done, done, done. Buddy, you ready for this? Probably not. Oh, damn. I'm not ready for this. Alright, I guess I will. Probably could have 
cheesed him using the lightning attacks. And he can't open this door. I've been to those ruins yet, so we'll stop there real quick. What's going on down there? That's my second pumpkin head. I got one the first guy I ever fought and I've never seen one since. Follow me things. Lead you to your death.
think there was something up there with all these guys over here. Oh. been in here or not. I'll take one of those. Yeah, just replace the two I lost. The one that I still use and the one that I lost during my death. get those open because I don't know if I've been in here
Who's got the key, damn it? Turtleneck meat. Hey, like that? The repellent torch. Beast repellent torch works when it's on the back. That's new. That's where I jumped in.
This is where I started. Is there any more cells up here? That's where it started. Cells look for that one that went down. One of the cells went down. This one. Right, that's the way I came in. originally Is that all this was? How the hell do I get out of here? This is one of my stone keys.
sweet. You ran right into that. How'd you get down here? Oh, he was killing all y'all. So sorry. That's how you got to this point. I jumped up here with my horse. And it was not easy. So I have never been in there. That's the first time I've ever been in there. Well, I had the sword, but... I got it doing it the right way. <laughs> Alright, we'll run down to the Dragon Communion building. Get any grace on the way, and then Caleb should be done. And the next stream, we'll start heading through all of the lakes. And I think, what is it? Not sure if I've ever gotten that either. <clears throat>
Jesus Christ, where are all these coming from? Stop it. There's a lot of guys over here for no reason. What the fuck? There's a lot of enemies for no reason. Bullshit. Make sure I do the Solus quest. He's got something I don't have. I also need to implement what's her name as King of the
sort of a set of grace here. Alright, let's go take on a dragon. Look at him, he knows I'm here. He smells my horsey. Alright, well. This will be the last bit of Kaled. He's killing the dragon. This guy is not easy to kill either. And use my mimic. Kaylid is complete. I'm going to die. Shy, a little more than a hundred thousand shy.
Spanish Knight Altered. I don't want the altered version! Alright, double check, make sure I got everything. Da -da -da -da. We'll go here just to make sure. Pretty sure that's it. That's the one I missed. that yet either. Oh, look at that. I've been down there. That's the way I came to get over here. Alright. So Kaylid is done. I am starving. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna go through the lakes. We'll do that next time. So I'm going to fast travel over to here. No. And I have not been up the right side at all. stream I am fucking hungry and we will go up the lakes and finish off everything in the lakes as much as we can anyway in one stream and head toward the volcano and all that but I need to make sure I don't skip any of the stuff I know I need to go to the Alexander Jar's house or town this oh I told the all here in brute already that I possess no such medallion or have you come to take more from me was my other half not enough I'm doing it Good-looking suit. Silver Maiden. Where is it at?
That's a good wizard suit. I like that. I should have killed her a long time ago. I'm pretty sure that was something to do with the quest, but oh well. suit. I'm tired of farming those guys in the snow. Alright. I don't remember how I got in here. I think it was through a cave. Yep. Alright. That's it. I'm gonna call it. I will see you guys later. You guys have a good night. Good day wherever you may be. Thanks for hanging out. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you next time. Later all.